what's going on everybody? So today I'm going to show you how I make my springtail cultures for all of my vivariums. So if you don't know, springtails are tiny little isopods that live in the soil and their job is basically just to break up all of the decaying matter and waste from your animals and dying plants and things like that. They're really essential to creating a bioactive environment for your animals to live in. They're really easy to uh, culture yourselves and you can have tons of them from just a tiny culture. So I'm going to show you guys right now how I make my cultures. So basically what you're going to need is a starter culture of springtails, some lump hardwood charcoal, and it has to be lump hardwood charcoal, not just charcoal briquettes. Um, usually Cowboy is going to be the brand you find. You can find them at Lowe's, Ingalls. I got this big bag from Ingalls for $15, so it's not that expensive. You're going to need some containers. You can get four of these little plastic containers from the Dollar Tree, obviously for a dollar, and then you're going to need distilled water and rice. Yeah, usually brown rice it works the best, but you can have any kind of rice. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to take your lump charcoal and you're going to smash it up. So the charcoal comes in bigger pieces like this and bigger, and that's a little too big, especially if you're trying to make a smaller culture like this. So you really want to break it up into smaller, more fine pieces like that. Now once you break it up, you're going to want to put it in your container and then just wet it a little bit uh, just to get the charcoal moist. Now once your starter container has started to come overgrown with springtails, you're going to want to make a new culture. So you take your culture and then you just kind of saturate it so that you can start to see the springtails rise up. They're going to get caught in the water, so the best way to transfer them is going to be in that water. You're just going to dump that water into your new culture. So you just kind of pour, move it around until you find a good group of springtails. It might take a few tries, uh, but you want to transfer probably 50 to 100 springtails into the new culture. Because you don't want to decimate your starter culture, you just want to start a new one. After you've done that, you want the water level on this culture you started to be about a fourth of the way um, to halfway of the charcoal. So if you need to add more water, go ahead and add it. If not, you're fine. Next, you're just going to add some rice. Uh, you don't need a lot of rice at all. What the rice is, is a food source for your springtails. Uh, so the mold will grow on the rice, and then the springtails will eat that mold. So they're not actually eating the rice, they're eating the decaying parts of the rice. Once you've done that, you just need to put your lid on and set it on a shelf and wait about one to two months, and you're good to go. Your culture will start to breed just like your starter culture. Now, for maybe $30, you can make... 10 to 15 cultures um, just from one bag of charcoal some water and some rice and that'll last you for a long time and it'll be able to supply all your vivariums so as always thank you guys so much for watching if you haven't already like this video if you have any comments or questions leave them down below and i'll get back to you right away and as always subscribe and i will see you guys next week